Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die, Day 44, where Lady Sheila and I are almost finished uh, looting a building. Well, we're not quite there yet, but uh, we're yes, getting there. We're very hungry and very thirsty. Yeah, we are, actually. Uh, yes, something we, we need to sort out sooner rather yeah. than later, but... If we can get a uh, little forge going at the at the staging base, I think we should probably make a point of doing that. Yeah, um, well, I'll have a look and see if we've got the stuff we need, but I didn't notice us picking up any duct tape, any... Uh, we did. Off and... Did get duct tape. Did we? Yep. Cool. Very cool. And we've got forged iron and everything we need to make duct tape, so it shouldn't be an issue. Head Either the way. basement and start... Pulling things apart down there. Oh, these zombies really have made a mess of this place, aren't they? Yeah. Why am they I trying to do that They don't care about tidiness, those zombies. Why am I trying to do that with an axe? Oh my lord. It's like everything <laughs> I, I knew about looting has just leaked out of my ears. Animal fat in the chemistry station. Nice. I would expect something a bit better than that in the chem station. Well, ah, you know. Uh, a stone sledgehammer. You know what? I'm just going to straight up scrap that. There is no reason to keep that around. Can I break you down? Yes, for seven polymers. Not bad. Very nice. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with the amount of polymers we've got. Yeah, we're getting loads actually in here. Right now, I'm just burning through the remainder of the uh, iron arrowheads that we had. Fair enough. And then, very soon... I'll be more or less exclusively using steel. Steel, yeah. Get some more food. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Now, the, the, the doors down here, I don't think can have brass on them, so there's no reason for us to worry about it. Oh, right, okay. Is it only like a certain type of door then? Only a door with actually, that visibly has brass handles on it, from what I understand. I was going to say, there was one that, that you were quite surprised at because it didn't seem to visibly have um, a brass handle on it, but it did give you some brass. Uh, okay, well, I'll try it then. I'm not sure, though, if it was a particular no. kind of door or, or what was going on there. but I'm not sure on that one, I'm afraid. <laughs> but... That didn't at all make me jump. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Right then, let's see what's back here. I'm quite eager to see what we can build at the the staging base. Yeah. We've got spare beakers back at uh, our main base as well, so we may be so we could able maybe to... even do chem sets and stuff. Just yeah. to make a little mental list of the things we might want to bring up here. Wow! Five wow. machete parts, two stun baton parts, three handgun parts, Ooh. and one rocket launcher part. That was quite the haul. My goodness. I'm put some more points into my uh, stun baton. Pretty happy with that little find. Yes, indeed. Yes, I can take electrocution of five. Oh, wow. She is becoming quite lethal with her weapons at this point. Yeah, not uh, so much. I am with out the of uh, perception, though. Unfortunately, I am now out of repair parts, so gonna have to get some more. What did I see there? I'm sure I saw something that flickered up briefly is lootable, but apparently not. Something coming downstairs. Right, I can't, uh, unfortunately, uh, harvest anything with an axe anymore. Oh, Because okay. I don't have uh, any... Ah, oh, you can do that for you, no problem. Oh, brilliant, thank you. Getting a bit low on the old repair kits, are we? Yeah, as in none. I've got one left. Uh, would you mind me using it? Once we get nope. back to base, we should be able to get some more. Well, maybe after we kill her. Oh, okay, Fine. you killed her. I'll give you the. I'll give you the. Repair. She got in the way of me repairing my axe. The scallywag! How dare! Or I thought I had a repair kit. Oh, um, it might be in my bike. Ah, no worries. Uh, okay, so if you could go, uh, chop down this, I'm gonna have to rely on you to uh, 
to be the door opener. Oh, medical bandage. Do you need it? Uh, I've got three. Bandages. I've been picking up a few as I've been going along. It's been quite nice, actually. Okay. Well, that's that for us, then. Would you um, like some frames to get out of here? Uh, I've actually got a bunch, but you can go ahead and lay them down instead. That's fine. What? Invisible frames. Let me out. How marvellous. Would I be able to borrow your axe, though, so I can harvest the uh, last brass doorknob from here? Sure. There you go. Thank you very much indeed. Oh, wow. Your axe is pretty beefy. Right, here you go. Thank you. No problem. Right then, is this the one that I've loaded up? Uh, yes, it was. So I've got this uh, repair kit here, so... There we go. Right, ready to go. Back to base, and then we can go grab the last quest, and... Uh, also, the airdrop. What do you think? Yeah, I reckon. And then we'll He's go back and look hand like everything a in. There's factory in the distance over there. Very large structure. That might be fun. Uh, that might I don't be think somewhere. I have quite the draw distance you do. That might be somewhere we'll be sent well, for a too. level five. Yeah. Because the factories are enormous complexes that take. <sighs> Unless you are really rushing and going straight for the, um, the treasure room, the stuff. treasure room, Objectives, and also yeah. know the factory, they will t typically take more than one day to complete. No matter how you go about it. Oh wow! They but it doesn't matter because you get so open. much stuff. We left the door open. I oh, know. No. Very oh, we're us. I know, right? Okay, so. Once again, just dropping things off in here as I can. Uh, there we go. Oh, I've got three repair kits. What? what? Oh, I must have put them on the vehicle. I'm sorry, silly of me. That was exactly what I did. When you're just like rushing and trying to put things away quickly. Yeah. It happens. I will remove this die because I don't care for the purple overalls. Also, kind of the purple overalls look better as purple overalls. Um, but I do care for the die. Alright, be right back. I'm going to go and grab some more stuff out of the bike. Oh, that was yours. Let me put... Um, Tools back on yours. There you go. All right. Going very, very well indeed. Oh, I've got some antibiotics as well. Yes, we do. So, for our forge, all mm -hmm. we need. Small stone, clay soil, leather, duct tape, short iron pipe. Right, let's see if I've got the duct tape and short iron pipe around. Oh, yes. It definitely should be. And two duct tape, and I think I need three. So there's glue there, and there's a. There's loads of there. things made of cloth that we could easily repurpose. No, that I think I've got enough. I think I do have enough. Excellent news. Right, so that I think is enough duct tape. So then small stones, clay and leather. Clay. Small stones. I'm just stripping out the uh, dyes out of things. Leather. Right, I think that's it. Okay. Excellent work. 
I'm not too worried about putting down like a land claim block or anything. We're not going to put anything particularly irreplaceable down here. No, exactly. In fact, the, about the only thing we're going to be placing here is forges. Whereabouts do you want them to go? Just underneath the, the uh, chests, yeah. Okay. It doesn't really matter where. Do you want to try and make... Well, I don't think we'll be able to make more than one at the moment. Just make one, and then we can start making the, the essentials from that. One yeah. of the very first things we need is just nails. Yeah, just nails and uh, like grill and cooking pot and stuff. Just be like another 30 seconds. I mean, I could. <laughs> I'm just, you know, crafting a, a bunch of loose iron into a stack of iron. And I'm going to get a load of EXP from it. So to, oh, Where yeah, yeah 9,000 EXP. But it seems to be going down with every time that that happens. So I suspect that there is a check and balance in there. It's just a bit comical. Right. And have you got the forge on the make? Yeah, it's just done. Just done. Perfect. Marvellous, in fact. One forge. Excellent. We've even got an anvil here, I believe. Where is it? Yep. Where is that anvil? It was definitely in one of the chests. Am I just looking past it, perhaps? Oh, no, there we are. There we go. Beauteous. I'm right, going to start smelting down the brass. Now, the idea here is not that we want to smelt all the brass into it. We want the brass in its brass form, just brass. The lead in its lead form. The iron in its iron form. So on and so forth. Yeah. And then we can just... Um, and the stone, can, we, can, we can happily be smelting the stone down into... Um, oh, we can turn that into cement. Cement, yeah, exactly. Uh, we've got loads of forged iron. Wow. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to pop a good chunk of the iron in there as well. Specifically, oh, well, it's actually going to take ages for that. I to bought like um, quite a big stack of forged iron from the main base, so that's why we have so much. Cool. We're going to want some iron in there so that we can make nails, so that we can then make yep. chests that can just basically be sat in the walls. For all intents and purposes. Also, the iron will allow us to make a grill and uh, yeah, a, cook a cook pot. And from that, then, we'll have a pretty steady supply of food as well. So, all things told, this is going quite nicely. Um, I think we're doing well. This jacket has some very nice cold resistance on it. Wow. Versus the, the dust that I've got. Mm. It looks quite cool on you, too. <laughs> a white jacket. Yeah, I suppose so. Uh, let me grab the mods out of my duster. This is the this is by far a better item to wear in this environment. It looked so much better without this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna pretend that never happened. What? It looked so bad when I when I put the blue dye in it. So oh. bad. Oh my lord. Uh, okay, we're still working sometimes through Sometimes things this. don't show up with their proper colours, though. Yeah, like true. Sometimes I have to put pink dye in instead of purple to make it look purple. Where's the fat? I'm sure we have some. Yeah, there we are. Good, good, good. And... Where's the plant fibre? I was also certainly had to. This is like the first time we've ever had like multiple bases in like, you know, staging bases and things like that. Well, the first time we've we actually usually... made use of the idea, yeah. Yeah. We've we talked usually, about it here yeah, and there. Yeah, I think when we've. Oh, there's a, uh, a snow kitty. Oh, you know, I'm going to put you out of your image as quickly as I can rather than have you suffer. Snow kitten. There we go. We've also got a. Uh, uh, looks like oh, an engineer, dear. a nurse, two nurses. You got them? Yep. Engineers down. Cool. 
don't know where the nurses are, though. Oh, I see them. One to your right, and then there's another two in the distance. There's one much yeah. closer to your right. Be aware. I don't yeah. see the one that's much closer to my right. Oh, you may have... Oh, right, okay, sorry. You were... I thought you were aiming at a different one. Oh, I see. I see what you mean. There's really not much point in using a pistol for this. Especially with that... Uh, you depth perception. Or depth of field. Right. Heading back in. I'll make two more candles if I can. Dunk, dunk. Yes, I can. Marvellous. Right. We need to get some of this iron in there. We don't need much at all. 400, uh, I'll put 490 in there just in case uh, the grill does take a little bit more. That should be, yeah, plenty then. Right. There we go. Uh, close. Did you close the hatch as well? I think I did. Good enough for me. I'll check. Yeah, I did. There we go. Nice lighting. This base is so cute. <laughs> Glad you like it. Yeah. All right. Cooking grill needs 30 and the cooking pot needs 30. So we definitely don't need this much. Take most of that out. Uh, I'm sure. Okay. Yeah, and the nails probably barely take any. Uh, oh, actually, that's a good point. We do have the nails as well that we need to take care of, so... But they probably don't take much, you're right. So there we are. And then we'll pop the clay in there. Oh, damn it, that was a big stack. It's just going to take a little while to get it uh, broken down. Uh, we've got some chrysanthemums, so you know what? I'm going to make red us tea. some red tea. Or I would if we had the pot. Never mind. Ah, I'm yes. Jumping the gun there by a little That'll bit. That'll be there in a minute, though. It's fine. Yeah. Right, nails. Yeah, pretty much everything requires uh, clay. Makes sense, because yeah, we're basically moulding it from the clay. Does make sense. But yeah, it is going to be great when we have uh, a bit more food and water. Mm -hmm. <laughs> is there Go anything the that I can do to oh, actually, help at the part. moment? Would you like me to dig up any snow for water or anything like uh, that? We've actually yeah. got plenty of snow here, as it happens. Um, ah. So I think we should be okay with that. Could you just go and check that we have looted the uh, the vehicles, though? That we haven't yeah, got course. anything left in them. There might still be stuff left in there, actually. I don't think I fully looted mine. I Thinking may have. about it. Strange note, I discovered all my travels. What does it say? Read. Uh... Yeah, no, they're all looted. You did it. Kill some chickens with a nail gun. What? I have never seen that quest before. What kill was that, sorry, chickens kill some... with a nail gun. Kill chickens with a nail gun. Yeah. That's going to be extremely difficult. Yeah, chickens finding chickens away. is difficult. Yeah, and chickens run away and then... Oh well. Actually, we need 14 for two chests. Why does that keep me writing that when I say 14? There you go. Right, there we go. I honestly we have don't have time for a lot of those little quests. <laughs> you know, the little ones you find. They don't do too... They're not too bad, honestly. They're, they're decent enough. Right. We have now got everything we're going to need to make ourselves some red tea. Donk. There we Lovely. are. Lovely. This feels proper yes, now. I am so hungry and so thirsty. I don't think I'll be able to do another point of interest until I have eaten and drunk. Uh, I can grill meat. That's all I can yeah. do right now, I'm afraid. Um, well, actually, That's I could okay. boil we it too. We can wait. I could boil the meat, but grilled meat is just as good, honestly. Yeah. Um, there you go. And then you don't have to use Eating water. Eating grilled meat. Lovely. Being made as we speak. Steal red tea. Steal more red tea. Uh, get 
got some more nails. Need rest for you. <laughs> Thank you. You're like, please leave me some. Yeah, very <laughs> much. Do leave at least some for me. There we go. And the next thing we're going to be wanting to put in here is... I mean, I could smelt down the cans, I suppose, but really it's the lead that... Uh, actually, that lead is in its proper form already. Uh, we'll keep the, the ten short iron pipes. No reason not to. We will start smelting down more brass items. Right, yo. Yeah. Uh, okay, then. Things so, like mechanical parts and short iron pipes and things like that, they need to stay in that form, don't they? Yeah. Well, they don't need to. We could smelt them down just to take... Watch out. We could just smelt them down and take them back with us as iron. Yeah. And that isn't necessarily a bad idea. Signs. I want two of those. Let's take the lock off. This little base is actually kind of better than the base we have. Like, <laughs> I mean, it's it's a bespoke base, yes. It's actually, yeah, properly crafted. I'd like to have an area like this, like under the horde base. Well, it's definitely something we can do. Right. Except bigger what is this fancier. box for then? Let's say this one is for weapons and um, weapons and armor. Fair enough. Because we're not going to ha have quite as massive of a stock of these things as we did in the other base. So anything yeah. that you you would wear or you would wield. Um. And I would say mods for those items as well. Um, stuff that is only used to make them. So, for example, armor parts. Scrap. We need some more wood for the forge. Hang on. Let's have some wood. That's it. Yep. Do you have... Uh, you got the wood? I put care of? two pieces there, but I need. Yeah, it needs more than that. Yeah, no, that's fine. I can put loads and loads and loads and loads here. There we go. Right, if you could start just moving weapons and armor across, that would be amazing. Of course. I'll prep the other one. Uh, this one can be for. Uh, well, actually, armor and clothing in one, and then weapons and tools in the other. Okay. I think that's probably a better division. Yeah. Things that you use, that you wield, and things that you wear. Right, so if you can just shunt those over, that'll be amazing. I think that's done there. Uh, and the clothing and the dyes can go in the clothing one because they are only used for clothing. Yeah. Same with any mods that are only put into um, clothing. I think that's everything. Excellent. I'm going to shove these across. The dies as well. to eat that meow chow. Okay. Not too bad at all, in my opinion. Sorted. Right. Almost done there. Uh, right. Uh, the next chest, what would we want? Should we have one for sort of like smelted metals? Like just pure iron, pure lead, pure this, pure that? Uh, sure. Because I know that's something we're aiming for. Uh, I'll, yeah, 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 absolutely. Um, though, how about we keep, like, hmm, 
I'll put this Up chest on the far wall. No, I think we do ne definitely need something for that, but I'm just trying to think yeah. how we would classify it, really. Um, but what we could have is a chest for everything that can't be smelted and then a chest for everything that can be smelted, if yeah. that makes sense. Yeah. Um, but how, like, unsmeltables and smeltables or smelted and unsmelted? As long as we sure. know what it means, yeah. yeah. There we go. For the time being, let's make this one the. Uh... There we go. Um, misc goods. Or I, actually, this chest over here we could have as. Um... Yeah, yeah, misc goods. Because we don't smelt it down at all. So everything that isn't something that we're going to break down. So okay. for example, acid. Bones, um, coins, burning barrel, batteries, yeah, um, engines. You're not going to smelt oil. You could smelt mechanical parts, but you wouldn't because that'd be dumb. Uh, lights, uh, the iron shouldn't be moved across. Paper, plant fiber, old cash, aloe cream. Where's my bandages? Um, Springs could be smelted, and there's a part of me that says we should. Uh, sewing kit. Polymers. Painkillers. Fuel. Engines, yeah. Mechanical pa uh, Electrical parts, yeah, okay. Awesome. We'll have, a, we'll have a separate box for cooking supplies, I think. I was okay. wondering if we should have one, but I think we should just put those into a separate place entirely. There we go. I'll put the gunpowder into the weapons and tools chest. At this point, we're starting to get everything kind of into one space, which is getting much yeah. easier now to see Everything's what we're doing. Everything's feeling a little bit more tidy and organized. Yep. All right. Medical supplies going in with the cooking supplies or in the miscellaneous goods? I just put them in the misc goods for now. Uh, I could, I suppose, but... Um, you know what, let's make some more nails then. I'm going to need a little bit more iron for that. Yeah, 60 will do. Okay, right. Definitely getting all nice and set up now. Yeah, this is actually starting to look really nice really now. good. Well, once these nails are done. We'll have one more box nails. above there for the cooking stuff. That makes yeah, sense. Exactly. Why does that keep going down to 16? I don't. Hmm. Maybe that's how much I could have made when I first opened it up and started typing it in. There we go. That was a very weird sort of glitch. I could see that there was enough iron in there, but it wouldn't oh, allow right. me to uh, to set any like more up to it. be made. Yeah. Oh, how more. weird. Ah, that's fine. Must have just not recognised that the iron was smelted in I there. Yeah, I, even though it had smelted, I think it had smelted after uh, since after I'd opened the the, the forge, mm -hmm. so it didn't recognize it. It's my best guess, anyway. Right. Okay. Going really well at this point. Once again, make sure that's unlocked. The only thing that's not going so well is the time of day. Yeah, I was a little bit worried about that. What we should do is we either head straight to the... Um, airdrop and then the the point of interest but we might be in the point yeah. of interest until the night yeah or we just grab the airdrop in the morning before we leave i think we should go to the the airdrop now personally okay uh, we'll leave the honey in the misc area uh, fat berries water meat Cornmeal, snow, yep, all of those come with. 
some grilled meat with me. Yep. And I would say, pretty much, there we go. More or less, everything left is to be smelted down. You can even smelt down the steel, if we're, if I'm perfectly honest. Yeah. But keeping it there allows us to do some repairs on, on certain odds and sods, if we needed to. But yeah, well, that is that is absolutely marvellous. I think we'll just have one I like that little base. chest in here. Really I know, cool. yeah. I'm... I'm, I'm unreasonably happy with what we've managed to do here. I know. The next step is to get another two um, forges, I would say. Yeah. And then we're and then we're good. Right, okay. Really, it's just um, duct tape. Just like glue and cloth and yeah. stuff. And then I'll Heading be able to get more done easily. Right. Are you already on your way to the airdrop? No, you would. No, I'm cool. right behind you, Luke. Right there, then. And Off we right go. here. And there. Give me a second. I am just going to Ooh. switch my uh, quest. You're like, give me a second. Ah! Yeah, sorry. I realise I probably have. Right, there we go. I've switched my quest now to the uh, tier three. Cool. And we can swing by and do that. And before we head back, basically. Yeah. This, this has been really cool. I've I this is what I was hoping to to be doing honestly from like the after the first horde night was to get out there and uh, set up yeah uh, but it, it takes bases. a little bit to set the infrastructure up to be able to do that i think yeah i think it's a bit more of a late game thing honestly yeah it certainly does feel like that some coal around here that's pretty cool fairly certain this is the same yes it is this is this is our house <laughs> this is the place that we're currently set up in oh that's amusing Hello. There we go. Came back up? Yes, you are. Hey, you've got the goggles on, haven't you? So. You might be the uh, best yes, one to I loot do. this. Oh, it doesn't really matter, though, does it? I mean, no. I can if you'd like, but. I'm not That's fine, away. I'll get it. I got it. So we got some leather boots, antibiotics, level five iron sledgehammer, first aid nice. kit, and five pain pills. Nice. Not bad. That's decent. We might want to actually wipe out that uh, this point of interest again, because again, it's the one that we're currently using as our base. Yeah. So it's going to have the military complex at the bottom. Yeah. Or at That's the very least, cool. we should remember where it is. I think possibly remember it is and just go do the quest for now. But yeah, that, that's going to be a nice one to uh, to swoop through later on. Am I gone funeral? Uh, the answer to that is probably a big fat no. Uh, is this the quest? Oh yeah, it is. Hey, I'm at our next quest, Sheila. Just waiting yeah, on Yeah, I am right behind you. Right, yep. I just parked the bike over here. Oh, I see. Just out of the way a bit. Ah! Sorry. You scal scallywag? Scoundrelly, <laughs> my lord. Scoundrelly wag. Scoundrel, sh shush! I almost got run over by someone I trusted. All right, I was, I was vexed. <laughs> so sorry. Okay, I forgive you. This one's. Is this the one with the pool around the back? Uh, no, no, I don't believe so. No. Right, let me have a Go sip on. of tea before we begin. And we are ready to go. This is just a fetch quest, it looks like. Oh, there is a... Lumberjack dude over there. Nice kill. Okay, this is just a nice fetch quest. Are you taking a shot? No? Okay, good. We could go in the guns blazing if we really wanted to. Oh, there's apparently what? a rabbit just over there. <laughs> oh. My little uh, my little compass was letting me know that there was uh, indeed some wildlife nearby for me to hunt. Oh, I got friends in here. You good? Running friends. Watch out! You're directly in my line of sight now. Sorry, I'm trying to get out of your line of sight. 
Yeah, we're good. good. They were quite tanky, those guys. Hello, I heard you coming. Oof, that was uh, a little bit more fun than I was expecting. There we go, 48. Nice. Got my level. I'm going to quickly spend that point, if I may. Oh, um, maybe the may. cuts, perhaps. I'm just going to pop these cupboards and see if anything comes out of them. Sure, by all no. means. Uh, card is no. No. Oh, you. Hello. <laughs> so polite. Oh, hey, hello. What are you doing here, then? Hello. Are you having a nap? I wouldn't mind that one killing blows grant 10 stamina. Well, that would actually be rather yeah. awesome. Right, That's I need to uh, handy. switch over to my EXP goggles for now. And moving through. I'm not being stealthy. I should be. How are you doing, Sheila? Good. The military zombie? No. What? Got something to the Little side. Biker. I'm backing up, backing oh, up, backing sorry. up. Oh, <laughs> sorry. It's okay. Incoming biker. Sorry. Oh, that's okay. It's down. Thank you for the help. You're more than welcome. And my. Stuff is above. This is not a uh, a clear. Clear. Class. It's just a fact. How are you doing? Have you got? Mm. Uh, is your item on this floor or above? It's above. So could you grab those arrows exactly behind where? you? Hi. Or a funny feeling that are going to be mines in this place. Uh, I don't know. It's only like a level three, isn't it? Yeah, but there's so many traps in here. Seems like the sort of place that would have had mines. Yep, hello. Possibly. And that looks very much like your career satchel. Yeah. Yep. You go ahead and grab it then. Mine is on this floor, just in a different direction. It's in that direction. Yeah, it's back around there. Okay, we're going to have to go out for mine. Are you looting at the moment? No. Okay. I was just looking at the bookshelf. I was like reading the Magnum Enforcer book. <laughs> have you got uh, nerdy glasses or have you got lucky looter glasses? I think I'm on lucky looters at the moment. I know I was saying that I didn't have those, but I think I do. Well, in that yeah. case, you can just go ahead and loot it all you want, really. Cop. Pistol. Oh, da 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 da. You alright? Yeah, heartbeat sounded. And I was literally stood in front of him. That would have killed me. Uh. Yeah. I would not have been a very happy camper. I would have been a very dead camper. Right, it looks like my. Uh, my objective is in here. I strongly suspect it's going to be behind this window. Yeah, there it is. Something woke up. Yeah, got it. Right, okay. We can be loud as you like now and start uh, tearing everything apart. If you would like to. Whoa. Nothing is particularly uh, rough now. Got some more bullets for you. Oh, awesome. I is randomly really itchy. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you ever get that when you have like a really itchy eye? Uh, do you mean the eyeball or the like, eyelid or? No, just sort of the edge of your eyelid. Um, yeah, yeah, I totally get that. Eyeball, not so much. But eyelid, yeah. You good? Oh, no, he's behind me, lumberjack. You good? Yeah, you've managed to take I care of it. I think he's down. Yeah, he is. Well done indeed. 
I am so sorry. I didn't realize there were still things in you you were attacking. I nicked it's the chair okay. out from under you. Thought it would be funny. But then uh, it was like, oh no, she's still shooting. How cool, I got a wrench. Ah, fantastic. Uh, everything in here. Go for the ones at top. Always those corner cupboards. I always miss them. Ah, uh, yeah. For some reason, they, they always they always escape your attention. Oh, calm down. Should we go group burst mod? Nice. Sort of shotgun mod, and bunker buster mod schematics. Very nice. Hmm. Wouldn't mind that bunker buster mod. It's the schematic that you have to make it. Oh, right, right. Fireman's Almanac 2. Do you have that one? Uh, I think you were doing the fireman stuff. Okay, well, I will use it then because I don't have it. Thank you. Um, there is a pistol schematic. Uh, I did best off learning that. Yeah, if it's you just a pistol schematic, that, then uh, yeah. you should absolutely be the one to grab that. There's loads of books in here. This is amazing. So many bookcases. Just paper in that one, though. More bullets for you. Uh, motor tool large tank mod schematic. Oh, that would be good. Uh, here's 42 bullets. Sure. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. Welcome. There you go. Thank you for the bullets. Dunk. Yep. Have I been smashing all of the doors? Uh, most of them, not all of them. Are. I like the way they created this to look like a television with a with a little stand there, just by using the frames. That was actually quite clever. Well done. I approve of your clever That's use your of your footsteps. Building. That's fine. Hello. Stand back. Good. I've got another skill Pistol. point to use. <laughs> In the Found a pistol in the toilet. Doesn't happen very often, so now it's actually oh. uh, something. Oh, zombie cop! Ouch. Oh no, he's gonna blow! He's gonna blow! No, he's not. You are so good at that. The good one ah. I need to be. Oh no, you got him already. Well done. I didn't. That was a hip shot. <laughs> we are good. They need to stop putting zombies in wardrobes. Seriously. Especially the zombie cops. How on earth do they get in there? I know. How do they fit? It's physics at this point that I'm questioning. I imagine you've got all the Pistol Pete books at this point, have you? Uh, no, I don't believe so. That's the first. I've got the first one of it. Let me have a look. I do not have the first one. 9mm Ooh. weapons have 20% more range when sighted. That would be amazing for me. Absolutely amazing. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Drop it for you. Thank you very much. No one's got a full collection of anything yet, though, have they? No, we've got lots of parts from lots of different collections, but yeah. no full ones yet. There will be ferals upstairs. I was going to say, like, we would definitely Just an have... FYI. All right. There we go. Right then. Go get this treasure room. Oh, balls. There are sleepers. You could take them out stealthily or... I have to jump and then... Or I could just be me. Ah, balls. Now is not the time for me to be unable to make jumps. Zombie cop. And he's I down. See him. Okay. 
We're not in a high stress situation right now. We've got all the time in the universe to take a shower. Oh, it's just because I couldn't see the pop, you know? Yeah. No, it's how I couldn't help you. Oh, man. Yeah, one okay. minute he was in one position, and the next minute he was like two meters lower. He'd like sunk into the block. <laughs> Like, yeah, it. it happens a lot, actually. How dare you? No worries about that, though. The nice treasure room in here. Yeah? Hmm. Over here, look. All the boxes and medical supplies. And okay, cool. Switching cool to my uh, goggles, then. Oh, lots of nice ammo for me. 31 ammo for you there. Go ahead and grab that off the floor. Wonderful, thank you. This is good. Medical supplies, some more antibiotics, which is always Machete good. Shetty parts, steel spear parts, baseball bat parts, rifle parts. So many parts from so many things. I am extremely happy with this. Let's grab that though. Another repair kit, um, another chest armor. Let's grab the glass. Amazing. I, I am actually. Hurting for space. Lots of sledgehammers for some reason up here. Yeah, we're hurting for space. We haven't even started looting this place properly yet. Here's some... Uh, oh, I've been looting it quite aggressively. Here's some more Fair ammo enough. for you, Shelab, right around here. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. So much ammo for Shelab. Back well, to having... Uh, you've been going for a while long. without, so it's only fair. Yeah, 200 odd now. I was down to 76 at one point. And that is not good. Being no. less than 150 is terrible. Yeah, I've been fairly aggressive with my looting, so there's not much of this place left worth looting. Cool. So um, we could pretty much just go... Yeah, more or less, I would say. Which might be uh, a good idea, because it's I nearly 10 o'clock. I can't carry much more, though. Um, but right. I want to try and get some polymers out of these boxes if I can. Yeah. Do you want to grab... Do you want to dig things up? I'm digging and chopping. Okay. We can definitely compress polymers then, because I have a stack yeah. of those. Give me the drink. Last bit of tea. And then I'll immediately scrap that glass. That'll compress a little bit more of my inventory. But yeah, not a bad little point of interest, this one. No, this though it's only a level one. three. I can't wait for the level five, so they're going to be really interesting. They are monstrous, though. Yeah, monstrous, but interesting. True, true. but Those yeah. we might want to start looting as we go along, though, because... Oh, yeah, definitely. Do you want to dig that up before I uh, wrench apart yeah. the stuff around it? There we go. Perfect. I'm not sure if I'm dropping parts or not. No, you're not. You must Excellent. have all of them stackable. Right. I'm fairly certain there's at least one more um, door that I need to go through. Oh, I went the wrong way around here. That I haven't chopped down yet and I want to. Okay. One more piece of brass uh, to get. Yeah, pretty much. There we go. In fact, there are two doors that I haven't chopped. Ooh. I'm just going to head back to the motorbike. Right, yep. I'm so slow. Got three places. Oh, actually, we hadn't fully searched everything back here. We've got a... Uh, some gore, some bones, some other bits and bobs, some other odds and sods, etc, etc. It looks like we have come through here. Yeah, it looks like this was the point where we had managed to gather everything we needed and we resolved to leave. Yep. Oh yeah, we haven't done the downstairs portion at all yet. Oh, I'll come back in then. I just yeah, went there's a, stuff to my motorbike. Yeah, there's a whole area out here that needs to be fully... Uh, like, the basement needs to be completely looted. Where are 
send that to my motorbike as well. Oh, if you go through the front door that I just chopped open, you can easily access the uh, basement area. Ah, right, okay. You get to the basement from the outside then? Uh, well, it's we came up from in the basement, basically. I see. Oh, so if I came in the so way that we stuff. came in, then I'm in the basement, am I? Yeah. Yeah, effectively. It, it's kind yeah. of a, an upside down house. The. Uh... Yeah. You know what I mean. Let's head and down. I know what you mean. Never lived in a house like that. I kind of want it though. Well, the house oh, we're in at the seats. moment has some like weird levels to it. Uh, that's true. Definitely got some friends going to join us. Yeah, there we are. Gonna come through the uh, door there. I'm gonna help you. I got a coffee schematic. I can I can keep it for you. A coffee schematic. Mm-hmm. Having a laugh. Having a giraffe. Uh, Mate. Yeah, you gotta you gotta add the meat or it doesn't doesn't work. Yeah. But got some rifle parts, so hopefully once you've got the schematic to make um sniper rifles. Yeah. Like, don't you already I'm have on... that actually? Oh, I'll tell you what I'm on at the moment with that with all of that. I currently have Dead Eye Three Marksman, which allows mm -hmm. me to make um, quality four. four rifles. Sharpshooter will allow me to make five, and uh, level five would just allow me to do more damage. I think. Yeah, don't having you already picked up a schematic to make sniper rifles though, like rather than. Like hunting rifles, but actually, oh, like a marksman rifles. rifle. Yeah. I don't know. Fairly soon. No, it's still locked for me. Really? Hmm. So I need to pick that up still. Is it locked based on skill or is it locked based on not being at the right. Like, because you can only make them at workstations. I think it's. Um, I think it's locked based on me not having the schematic. Huh. Level four sle uh, steel sledge. Hunter's Journal, Volume Four. Mountain lions. These dangerous cats are often found in the snow-covered mountains. Do ten percent more damage against them. Yes, please. I yes, accept. we are finding lots of them right now. Oh, a beaker. Nice. Oh, excellent. We can pop that in the fire, and then we can start uh, making medically stuff. Medically stuff in the campfire. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm doing well. Good stuff. I've pretty much stripped this place of everything. In that case, we can just bust out of the garage door. I do need to do a quick sweep to make sure that I've gotten all the doors, though. One part I haven't confirmed yet. Fairly certain I haven't, because I didn't take any of these doors apart. But yeah. That's pretty much us done, I would say, with this place. Yeah, we've done really well. Yeah, these last couple of... Uh, oh, there's a trash bin left behind. Just paper that. Just make sure there's no secrets hidden in the walls. Doesn't look like fun. But yeah, pretty happy with what we've managed to do today. Yeah. I am too. We got, like... Well, in the last two episodes, anyway, got like so much of this done. Yeah, the the expansion down here and getting that little extra base. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, si I'm sitting happy here with, with loads of White River supplies to hand into all the traders. I know, same, exactly the same. It's actually kind of annoying that I can't store them anyway. I have to. Yeah, I know. But then you'd be really annoyed if you didn't have them in your inventory when you had to turn the quest in, so... It's true, but I'd, I'd, I'd accept the annoyance, I think. It'd be like, well, I am the source of my own annoyance here. Right, this one's mine. Let me know when you're ready. 
Ready to go. Okay, off we go then. Yeah. If we set up uh, our... Oh, you know what? I'm going to take care of him. Ouch. Of course, you know, Sheila could run me over instead. Sorry. It's okay. He's not dead. He's now. Is he dead now? Did I attract him? <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. He's a very annoying uh, one to kill, huh? Yeah, oh, there's another. Totally missed. There you go. A two times scope wouldn't be a bad investment for this pistol, honestly. Yeah. I think I can make them. Maybe I should, in fact, get a. Uh... There are loads of wraps around here, my lord. Uh, maybe I should get, like, a two times scope for my pistol and then have an SMG with me. Yeah. For close quarters combat. There's loads of AKs and stuff kicking around the base. Yeah. Yeah, but an SMG would play off my dagger skill, so... Uh, my dagger skill? Oh, right. uh, <laughs> my pistol skill. My dagger skill. Yeah, because uh, as everyone knows, an SMG doesn't actually shoot bullets. It shoots knives. It's actually a bayonet. <laughs> it's a ba bayonet projection device. Ah, me and you. Um, we seem to be clear. We're good. Yeah. There's one like over there, miles so? away. Yeah. Well, if they're not going to be bothered by us right now, I'm happy to just. They're not going to bother us. Things and are down. Be bothered by us. Yes. Yeah. Just gonna ferry bits and bobs down here now. But yeah, that level four sledge. Oh, so four. many, so many sledgehammers. The level six sledgehammer here, but it's only iron. Right, okay. The level four sledge is my sledge. Yeah, I've got a level 4 steel sledgehammer on me right now. You may want to check that out and see if it ends up being uh, slightly better than the one you got. No, I don't have my my sledge on me. I, it might be on my bike. Let me check. I'm like, have you got my sledgehammer? No, I found it. There we go. Everything. Shunt it across. Right, yeah. There's mine. Close back up. Quite a few little mods and stuff we picked up, which is kind of cool. Yeah. I'm just going to move the bike out a little bit. And up onto the road. Okay. So it's not near the base. So if something is interested in coming over there and saying hello... It's unlikely to also hit the bike. Yeah. Really? There we go. Okay. Armor and clothing. There we are. Done and done. Right, heading back in. Did you get everything out of your bike? Not quite. Sure, I'll grab what I can then. Thank you. There you are, I knew I saw you. Pop. Was that a head pop? No, it was just a blood splatter, unfortunately. There we go. I think I have cleared all the zombies around the staging base for now. Uh, actually, you know what? Well, then. 
just to be air on the side of caution, I will move your bike up. Maybe mine as well. Thank you. Oh, damn it! All right. Stupid bloody bikes keep ragdolling me. It's the most <laughs> annoying thing in the universe. Ah. Uh, they're trying to kill me. Right, what are we doing we with glass jars right now? They're just going the miscellaneous one. Oh, you can smash them and uh, smelt them into into glass. or uh, Well, actually, I think they smelt into sand. Um, when you smelt sand, glass maybe? down, yeah. Oh, I grabbed all the other gear out of... Uh, out of the, the bike, sorry, I brought all the... Oh, that's okay, don't the worry. Stuff and things in here. My bad. Um, bones. Paper. Ah, I can't box me some Do you want to learn to make Bunker Buster mods? Uh, yeah, sure. Okay, I'll drop that on the ground for you then. Oh, I've already learned this one. Okay, I'll learn it then. Oh, you didn't know it yet. Sorry, I, I wouldn't have said yes if it was uh, if I realised that you were giving <laughs> up learning it yourself. I will, however, learn the trigger group burst mode schematic, if that's okay. Yeah, sure. There we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. The Shotgun Messiah, Volume 7. Book. And, well, you're not going to use shotguns. There's almost no chance of that, so I'll use the uh, shotgun mod schematic. But the yeah. uh, at least the Shotgun Messiah, Volume 7 book is going wanting. You might as well use it. I right, need to get me some nails. I think a, that's most of the stuff I need to put away, put away. Nails. Just some drinks and stuff, really. Right. I'm just going to make a uh, another box and sign. Okay. I'm just going to place it above this, and then we're going to get rid of that other chest, and then we're good. Eventually, we could have just a, a bunch of cement mixes in here if we wanted to. But realistically, there's not, not particularly much point in doing that. I'm going to no. be honest with you. Um, We're just going to end up probably taking a lot of stuff back on our bikes and in our inventories and take it to the yep. other base, aren't we? Exactly. And then eventually we'll have a nice base like this kind of under our horde base and we'll have most of yeah. our stuff in there. And then we'll have little bases all around the place just staging. Exactly. That's the plan, anyway. That is the dream. A good plan. I think it's a very good plan. Even if it does take like an in-game day to make a, a staging base. Yeah, but it was it was nice, and we'll we'll get loads of different designs. Yeah, uh, it'll, it'll actually be quite cool to see what we can make, how we can make all them. these little tiny places around the place, and all yeah, the just different, kind of, as you say, different designs. Yeah, I do sort of wish that I had left. This is flagstone. The perimeter and the stairs. Oh right, rather than cobbling just it this, up. Yeah. This this one wall is cobble, just to make it stand out just that little bit. Mm. I think that would have looked really nice. Lesson for the future. Maybe you can paint it back to flagstone. <laughs> Good. Cool. I think there might be a paintbrush around somewhere. Uh, well, I shouldn't call it s um, smelting. We'll just call it. We'll just use smelting as the uh, thing there. Uh, but yeah, we might be able to do that. There is a paintbrush indeed, and there are some dyes. But I believe they're only purple dice. Are you alright with me? You can certainly those use down? the purple dice, it's fine. Yeah. You know what? If I'm <laughs> using the purple die, I'll also also use one of the reds to make it fair. <laughs> there we go. Alright, let's have a look then. Materials. I would like Um What kind of ones have we got? Flagstone. Well, we've got quite a lot of, of options in here, actually. Uh, 
Could get really fancy if you wanted. Oh, now you've discovered all the different paint options. You're like, oh. Yeah, pretty much. I'd forgotten I could paint it. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Example. Grab a carpet. Oh, how lovely. I have to pick up the bad rolls, unfortunately, but could okay, you pick I'll up pick yours? Up mine. I'll pop it back down in a second. Did you also move just from that spot? Yep. Am I in your way? Yeah, for some reason it won't let me place it there. Oh well. I'll put mine on this side then. Dunk. There you go. And then... So oh, I we'll think it doesn't like the forge being in, the, in that proximity. Oh, no, I did it. That's cool. Yeah, that does look better. Without doubt, it's much better look to it. Having this as flagstone. Yeah, I think so, too. <laughs> just stay out of your way. Can I not paint that properly? There we go. Looks at like the hitbox is slightly wrong there. By painting it looking down, I painted the front on, and painting it from the side, painted the top. That's fine. Ah. May just run out of uh, paint here as a result of that. I might be lucky. Oh, oh. There we go. Perfect! Yay! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Perfect! Yay! Hooray! <laughs> just ran out of uh, Oh, paint. it's looking cute. Yeah. No, I think this looks really quite nice, actually. Really, really quite dapper. I'm really pleased with this little little base. Uh, I will now move all of the items, though, across from that chest and then demolish the chest. Don't need it yeah. there anymore. Have I forgotten to unlock one of the chests? Um, I don't think so. No, cool. Let me just check. I thought I heard oh, yeah. your uh, unlock sound. No. My mistake. No, we're good, I think. That coal doesn't need to be in there. Coal needs to be over here instead. But there we are. I'm the only one that forgets to lock chest, unlock chests even. Okay. I'm super pleased with uh, how those quests went. And we can uh, yes. probably, honestly, need to just gather all these materials and take them back with us. Um, at least the, the smelting materials and the concrete and things like that. Um, but yeah, that's it for now up here we will be coming back up this way in the fairly near future because we've got uh she labs fetch and clear quest still to complete there yes but other than that we can head back and on the morrow hand in three quests for a fairly hefty sum of money and experience yeah. yeah almost ten thousand for the uh tier fours Wow. And several thousand dukes as well. So that's actually going to be pretty, pretty nice. But that's going to be it for us. Hope you've enjoyed, everyone. Do let us know down in the comments if you did. And we will see you next time. But until then, do take care. And keep being awesome.